it feels like it's 10 o'clock but it's only 6 p.m and it's driving me absolutely insane anyways get ready with me friend miss edition everything i need is in this bag so every year we do friend miss me and my sister combine friend groups because we legit have no friends um and we just have dinner and do gingerbread houses and wear our pjs and exchange gifts and it's a lot of fun so we usually do it at my house but unfortunately this year we don't have space in our home because we went from a house to an apartment building so we don't have space to do like anything super big so our friend lexi is doing it for us and she's so cute she made like a whole invitation and everything like that and i'm really excited so she told everyone to bring so it's like around 10 people or eight people either way but she, we all have to bring a dish like could be dessert appetizer food or whatever but we have to bring a dish literally saying the word dish so many times just brings me back to that like demi lovato meme where they ask her like oh what's your favorite dish and she's like Oh, I like mugs because you know they keep they keep my drinks warm and that was like not what she meant by the question but years later apparently she meant to do that and I'm like did you though so I am bringing like appetizer and I don't know how to cook your girl doesn't know how to cook okay and I was stressing because I thought I had to like cook something and I was panicking because I don't want it to come out disgusting and everyone's gonna be like barf you know so I just bought I don't know if you guys have seen those things at like Walmart they're like that breaded sausage square things that you just throw in the oven and they're all good to go well that's what I brought coffee break um I was planning on bringing dessert but our friend Lexi the one that's hosting it loves to bake and she made like 150 cookies and like other desserts and I'm like what am I gonna bring now but honestly like I'm not even upset about it because this girl bakes the best fucking cookies in the whole world like I legit love her cookies and I'm ready to be munching on them because so my gingerbread house this year is once again the Kit Kat gingerbread house because I'm never going back honestly like I've I know there's like the Oreo gingerbread house and stuff and just like the regular one but I love the Kit Kat one I love because I can actually like enjoy eating it once I'm like done decorating their shit out of it and don't hate on me like I love the you know original gingerbread houses but I just don't like gingerbread like I don't really like vibe with it it's not my preference and now i can like actually enjoy my gingerbread house after the fact so i'm gonna do my eyeshadow and girl i have been obsessed with the ghost face eyeshadow palette by glam light i have never seen such like perfect gray pigments in my entire life like i'm not even kidding i'm so excited for christmas this is my first like time ever living in an apartment building and first of all i'm really happy because like i don't have to shovel snow this year and i can watch everyone else just struggle to shovel snow and not me which is like such a bonus this year and i'm also just excited for it to like just be snowing and i can like sit with hot chocolate and just watch the snow fall from outside it's such a like vibe it, it gives I think Home Alone vibes, like when he's at like the fancy ass hotel. This year is gonna be a small Christmas because we usually like gather with like my cousins and my aunt and all that. But this year, unfortunately, it's a little different because my aunt did move to Alberta recently, and it's just it's a little weird that it's just not gonna be everyone, you know, this year. Cause this is like my first Christmas without having like my aunt and like the whole family gathering so just like a little bit weird but i'm also just you know i'm excited to also just kind of be in the comfort of my home and just kind of have my parents and my sister and her boyfriend i'll just like spend time and just kind of have like a chill christmas i did my eyeliner off camera because i can't do it on camera properly if my life absolutely depended on it like tell my family i said i love them but it's not gonna happen Ooh, girl said blush. Ooh, I'm using the Glam Light 
ghost face blush and let me tell you right now this shit anyways after i was really interrupted by this brush flying off my hand i like to do blush first before i put on my bronzer i just feel like it blends better in all honesty and like my opinion i could just feel like You know? Okay, I feel cunt. I feel cunt. Okay, I do feel like it might be like a lot of blush, but you know what? Honestly, I don't care. Just blend that shit out. Just blend it out. I'm gonna do my fake beauty marks. Like, I have three real ones that you can't really like see. Like, this one right here, and then this one right here, and this one right here. Kind of forms like a little bit of a weird triangle, but I'm gonna add some fake ones because I've been doing it a lot recently because I, I don't know, it's just like it's just vibe it's just vibe, okay okay wait, hold on <laughs> no. redoing that one because Okay, purr. And I'm just gonna like go for the real ones. A little bit, so. Cause they get covered with makeup. I'm doing my lipstick really fast cause this video is like six minutes long. When it was not supposed to be six minutes long and I apologize for, you know, yappa yappa yappa. Oh girl, seven minutes now. Giving cunt. It's giving cunt. Love ya.